everybody. Welcome to another YouTube video. Today we're going to be showing you how to play against Zed, uh, how to lane against him, how to, you know, combat every interaction so that you can win as Ari. Um, if the two players are on equal skill, generally Ari will have the advantage. Um, I would say it's about 55% to 60% uh, better for Ari than it is for Zed, mainly because like you can pressure a lot towards the uh, the early game and get a lot of advantages early game. So, oh, that's an invade. Wait, could have just queued. Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. How do you kill Zed level 1? Can't really kill Zed level 1 because you don't have enough damage to. Uh, but generally, you will start W against Zed. And you'll play in and out of his uh, Q range. So he, he gave up this space right here. So I can walk here now. I can start auto-attacking the minions. Okay. Whenever he gets into auto attack range, you want to auto W auto. Okay, and just sidestep the Q like this, and then you'll win the trade. So the the points you have to watch out for with Zed are level one, level three, and level six. All right, those are the main points. Whenever he goes up for uh, minions, that's when you can contest him and go for an auto W auto. If he ever walks up like that to get like a minion, you can always uh, go for a triple auto, proc electrocute real quick. Hmm. I'm gonna have to flash here. Unfortunately. Zach did come in after two camps. Uh, we're going to try to be careful here. Zed will hit level 3 here. After this minion. Okay, level 3 is where you have to be careful as well. Uh, I need help in mid lane. Because Zac is hovering. He missed one. I have to play very carefully because Zach is topside now. Okay, so you gotta watch. Whenever you play against Zed, you gotta watch the minions because that's the like one heal Q, and you just sidestep it. You can play around it, but sidestep the Q. Zach could. Okay, Zach is bot. Good. Okay, I can actually kill Zed now. His W is on cooldown. He's gonna Q this minion. Okay. So that's what you have to watch out for, like those minions that he's queuing. I'm actually going to reset because it's a little dangerous here. Okay, Zach should be topside now. Ward here. Go for a full combo, he's dead. Very nice. He thought I reset. So, he kind of walked in. You have to be careful about throwing your charm out against Zed because he has W to teleport to. But if you're able to land a clean charm, you can full combo him very quickly. Okay, we're going to reset here after clearing the wave. I would like to greed for another one, but I don't have enough mana. So, we're going to go for this. Okay, the next point we have to worry about. So level 3, uh, his shadow range is roughly the range of your Q, right? So if you look at Q range right here, this is roughly the shadow range of his like WE. You want to play outside of this range, but if you do play inside of the range, you can bait out his W, right, with ulti. So you can dodge his WEQ combo with ulti, and that's when you can go for an all-in. I'll show you guys uh, an example. Oh, and whenever he does that, like slow, uh, you can just W out. A lot of the times he'll uh, miss his combo if you do. Go for auto auto W auto there. He's gonna queue these minions, so we're gonna we're gonna push up so that he can't get it. Okay. 
So he had to choose between poking me or getting the minions, which he didn't do either. Which is really good for us. So he, his W is right here, right? So he can't really do anything about this. Okay. So he uses W wrong. Uh, you can ulti forward towards him and he can't combo. So you had to burn flash there. He's going to hit level 6. <clears throat> He's going to look for an all in here. Barely missed the Q. I needed to walk a little further before placing it. Unfortunate. If I got the electric cue, I would have lived because I would have killed him and then I would have gotten my passive, but I just mechanically misplayed a little bit. That's okay though. Uh, no ulti. He didn't use ignite, I don't think. Do you prefer Ari's old icon? Old icon or the new one? Uh, I mean, the new one looks a little weird, but I don't really mind, to be honest. Okay, we got our Lost Chapter. Lost Chapter is very good against Zed because uh, he's an energy-based user, right? So he doesn't have any mana resources. So when you're playing against him, it's kind of hard to get a good reset off if he doesn't have to recall, All right? So that's one thing you have to take into consideration. He's gonna auto this one. Okay. He didn't auto. He doesn't have Q for this then. So this is what's like like counting cooldowns is like. So he doesn't have Q there, he has to auto attack. You wanna be able to contest these minions. Okay, if he W's here, I'm going all in. All right, if he W like to combo, then I will ulti him and go all in. Very nice from the Vi. I don't think she had the flash, but uh, it was good. We secured the kill. Okay, Janna died. Uh, Zed still has ulti, so we have to be careful. Right? If Zack jumps on us and Zed ultis, we are pretty much dead. Alright, Zack is right here. His W is up, we have to be careful, because he could teleport to it and then ulti us. So right there, I did the trade of like, you know, charming Zed, but I knew he was going to go for the minion and stayed right outside of his ulti range after we did a full combo. Right? If you don't stay outside of his ulti range, he can just kill you right there. So you have to be careful when you use charm. You can't just throw it out to throw it out a lot of the times, right? Q is fine to poke, right? You can you can just kind of throw out Q to throw out Q, but charm you have to like make sure not to do it or make sure to hold. Um I would like to play for this. Ooh, that's a little rough. I wanted to kill Zack. I missed the charm, missed the Q. Okay, Zed has ulti. Nobody, nobody's around me, right? Zed has ulti and nobody's around me. I don't have ulti, I do not want to play up. Okay, Q, like I said, you can throw out Qs. Watch out for Zack coming mid. Okay, watch out this because he can ulti to that, right? Okay. 
So he could go to the here, that's why I queued this, but Zed just died as uh, Vi. So when you play against Zed, it's like kind of playing a mini game, right? You're playing a mini game within playing League. You're always predicting like where he can teleport to, right? That's the main main game when you play against him. Okay, Zach has passive. How do we know? If you look at his name, right above his level, he has like the Guardian Angel wings, right? That means he has ulti. Very nice, good job team. Zed's gonna come back. Uh, he won't have ulti for a little bit. Okay, I can reset here. <clears throat> He's gonna walk up and try to clear this wave, so I'm gonna reset over this way. Mm. I might actually stay. He's clearing it pretty fast. So we're gonna stay, get our lost chapter for mana. Alright, and safely farm under tower. Okay, we're gonna push this last wave. Could have gotten ultied there, so I want to be careful now. Zed can kill me. I am in lethal range. Okay, did he pop Herald? He did. Uh, Zach could come in again, so I have to be careful of that as well. Okay, Zach is top. Throw a little safe. He's dead. So if you saw exactly where I charmed there, <clears throat> Zed will always appear between where he ulted you from and on the other side. Oh, Zach can come in. I'm dead. <laughs> it's okay. I greeted. It's okay, I greeted. Sometimes you know it's gonna happen. <laughs> but you die anyways. <laughs> uh, uh, if you look at the team composition, we have triple AD. We can go lucid or er, not lucidity. We can go Ludens here and go Sork Boots as well. All right, if we wanted to do this, this is a possibility. Um, just for the sake of this game, I will go Ludens. I generally do not go Ludens. Ooh, but looking at the enemy team, v Zach and Orn. I might have to go uh, Leandries. Huh. Kind of unfortunate. Yeah, I think I'm going to consider going Leandries here. My, my character keeps stopping. There's a ward here. Alright, enough trolling. We'll, uh, we'll close out the game, play correctly. Have to be careful. Um, I do not have ulti currently. It was like three seconds. He's looking for a. He's looking for a combo here. Double kill, bot lane. Zach can jump from right here. Uh, Zed could jump to W, it is possible. Zion needs to be careful, he's like running straight into the enemy. <laughs> okay, Just hovered him a little bit so he didn't just like straight up int. 
Wily Andri this game, uh, mainly because they're top and jungle. Okay, so I'll show you the example of if he Ws forward, you can dodge it with ulti and go for an all-in. Right like this. All right, and then he'll ulti you. And then he'll appear on the opposite side, right there. You can just play just like that. So it's very calculated. Uh, I waited for the W to run out. If he did ulti me while his W was up, I would just ulti towards the W. All right. And then he would have no escape. Oh. Ooh, I almost died. I missed my charm, barely. That's okay. I will go bot lane. Your turret has been destroyed. Ooh, Orn is dead. Orn is dead. He's right there. He could just ulti him. An enemy has been slain. Dude, I, I think waiting is really bad because uh, Twitch, Janna, and Zed are all on resets. I think this is a really bad time to, like, stall. I think everyone's top. I think, I think everyone is actually top. Zed, Twitch, Zed might be bot. Maybe, we'll see. Okay, Twitch is top. We just don't see the Zed yet. Okay, so I'm gonna assume Zed is bot then in this bush. Maybe he's in this bush or this bush. The Zed is actually mid. Okay, Orn is here. We'll play against the Orn for a little bit. Alright, healing reduction. My HP! I can't kill him, so I don't want to ulti for this yet. Oh, we gotta go for it. I just had to go for it. I'm dead. Jana, no! <laughs> That's okay. Sometimes you die. <laughs> and that's okay. Ooh, he needs to be careful. There, there could be three people here. Is that his top? It doesn't look like he wants to group. Uh, Twitch is here. Uh, Zach is here. John is here. Seems like Zed does not want to group. What? Thresh? For a kill onto Zed. Start off with ulti. Alright, it's just that simple. The timing on when you have to charm him out of his ulti is a little a little off. Like sometimes if you haven't done it before, it might feel a little off. But when you play against Zed, you're going for an all-in. Lead with Ignite. Ign Ignite is like very, very strong because he can't dodge it, right? So you ulti Ignite, wait for him to use his abilities. That's when you W, E, or Q, all right? You can go Baron.
to Orn top. Twitch is mid. Or at least Twitch should be mid. I will react if Twitch does show up, so. Uh, and a lot of people might ask, like, should I go Zonia's? It's like, yeah, you can go Zonia's, but it's not, like, always the best against Zed. Uh, you can block his damage, but if you do it too early, uh, he might triple Shuriken you, which is also really bad. Uh, but, like, let's say, look at the composition. Like, let's say this was, like, a Xin Zhao and, like, top lane was, I don't know, another AD champion. Then, uh, potentially you could consider going Zonia's because it's, like, four AD champions and Zonia's has, like, uh, it gives, like, 45 AD, right? Or armor. Which is valuable either way. So in those kinds of situations, yes. Okay, my team is gonna throw here. Yeah, my team's gonna throw. Uh, Zach hard engage, Twitch invis. Okay, good, they backed up. Okay. Is that as no W? I could have gone in if I really wanted to. Twitch is also missing. I'm gonna wait for this uh, tower to get low and then I'm gonna auto attack it. He got in range to uh, Q the cannon, because I knew he wanted the Q. Um, so that's when we threw out the charm. If he decided to like W to the side and ulti me, I would have still killed him. Like either way. Like he had no options. GG. So thank you so much for watching. If you guys are watching from YouTube, hopefully this Zed uh, gameplay guide did help you out. If you guys have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section down below. I will read all the comments and uh, respond accordingly for you guys. So thanks for watching. And uh, don't forget, I am live on Twitch, twitch.tv slash LegitKorea. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. And uh, we can also check out damage as well if you guys like. Wow, fewer damage. Actually pretty high. He fought against Orn a lot, I guess.